Well, hey everyone, this is Shirish and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm back with another one of the amazing US University, University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. Well, before I begin this video, here's a quick update. Many of you have asked me about my program, Ivy Cohort. Well, every summer, I help small group of college applicants through my program, Ivy Cohort. It's an eight week high power live sessions with me to help you build your application from scratch. Well, my aim is to help you build winning applications to six different colleges. I truly believe in this program and because it's a small cohort, seats are extremely limited. So if you're interested, make sure to click on the link in the description box to get more details and enroll before it gets sold out. I will see you live inside the program if you wish to join the tribe of successful applicants. For this video, I will give you an in-depth view of the university and will decode the academic, social and financial aspects of the university with my star ratings. And then I will offer you the most important tips and strategies to get into this university. Make sure to listen closely as I'll be sharing most amazing strategies to get into UNC Chapel Hill. So let's head up to University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. Hi, I'm Shirish Gupta and I empower people to hack their success, rise above the challenges and confidently create an extraordinary life they deserve. The University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill is a public research university in Chapel Hill, North Carolina. It was established in 1789 and the flagship of University of North Carolina system. It is one of the oldest public universities in the United States. It is one of the public IVs, which include publicly funded universities, thought to provide a quality of education comparable to that of an Ivy League. Additional notable alumni include US President, US Vice Presidents, 38 Governors of US States, 98 members of United States Congress and 9 cabinet members as well as CEOs of Fortune 500 companies, Olympians and professional athletes. So it's a powerhouse. The location of UNC's campus is Chapel Hill. It's 15th largest city in the country and is a typical college town. The atmosphere has a unique brand of Southern and a mixture of hardworking, sports fanatism, progressive social values and traditions that seems to attract bright, serious and fun-loving people everywhere. UNC Chapel Hill has a 729 acres wide campus. It is very comfortable and has a lush green appearance with trees and lawns and brick paved walkways. The architecture ranges from Palladian, Federal and Georgian to postmodern with red brick and the prevailing motif. The old well, the university symbol, stands at the center of the campus. Recent construction includes a soccer and lacrosse stadium and a field hockey stadium. The most popular majors at UNC Chapel Hill include communication and media studies, chemistry, sociology, English, philosophy, biology, psychology, and economics. Although I'm not a big fan of judging a university solely on the basis of the ranking, UNC Chapel Hill still is one of the top 10% universities in the world, according to US News, QS News, and all other major ranking services. All right, now let's move on to our next section, talking about the right fit, starting with academic fit. At UNC Chapel Hill, academics are competitive, but collaborative in nature. No student has ever complained about this being an unbearable academic pressure. At the time of recording this video, Carolina offers 74 bachelors, 104 masters and 65 doctorate and 7 professional degree programs through the College of Arts and Sciences and its professional schools. Some of the strongest are Communication and Media Studies, Chemistry, Sociology, English and Philosophy. Other popular majors include Biology, Psychology and Economics. For UGs, the general education curriculum requires all students to complete 38 to 44 credit hours for coursework in three broad themes, foundation, approaches, and connections. Coursework include physical and life sciences, social and behavioral sciences, humanities and fine arts, composition and rhetoric, foreign language, quantitative reasoning, and lifetime fitness. For PG students, no such requirement is there for general education curriculum. Husband's School of Journalism and Media is world-renowned for its program. Business School has some amazing business and economics program. The School of Dentistry, Medicine, Nursing and Pharmacy also have amazing opportunities to take advantage of. Center for Student Success and Academic Counseling, CSSAC, helps Carolina students develop the skill and strategies necessary to succeed academically at Carolina. It broad range of programs help prepare students to become the next generation of leaders. More than 60% of students uh, in all disciplines take advantage of research opportunities and many present their findings at professional conferences, publish results in academic journals and win fellowship to support summer research in the United States and abroad. UNC offers more than 400 study abroad programs in approximately 70 countries in which one third of students participate. 
Additionally, UNC's honors program is nationally recognized as well. The faculty at UNC Chapel Hill is one of the best. The majority of professors go out of their way to help students. UNC's faculty include alumni with nine Nobel Prize laureates, 23 Pulitzer Prize winners, and 51 Rhodes Scholars. The class size at UNC Chapel Hill is small to average. 38% of classes enroll fewer than 20 students. So keeping all this thing in mind, I would like to rate Chapel Hill with four stars on academic difficulty and quality, level, where five is the highest level. After the academic fit, let's move to social fit. Social life is abundant here. Chapel Hill is a traditional college town. Academic and social life are governed by the student-run honor system. There are many student organizations, students that can take part of on the campus. Franklin Street, the main drag in town that runs across the northern boundary of campus, offers Mexican and Chinese restaurants, ice cream parlors, coffee houses, vegetarian eateries, bakeries, dance club, and a generous supply of bars. Fraternities are a social hub, and many students flock to their off-campus parties. About a third of students are involved in community service, many through a service learning program for which they receive academic credit as well. Fall Fest kicks off the school year with the emphasis on the idea that you don't have to drink to have fun. Students look forward to several annual festivals. Carolina Jazz Festival and Halloween Celebration on Franklin Street are always amongst the most popular. UNC Chapel Hill has about 30,000 students with about 20,000 as undergrad and remaining as PG and PhD. The university has a 5.8% student body as international students. Housing on the north side of the campus offers old and recently renovated dorms. The south side offers several new housing options which are 15 minutes hike from academic buildings. Just over half of the undergraduates live in the university housing. Most postgraduates live off campus. Meal plans are also available. The pickiest of the picky could be happy with Carolina dining services. Many off campus eateries are available as well with a wide range of delicacies, including vegan options as well. UNC is popular in sports as well. Men's and women's lacrosse, women's soccer and women's field hockey are also highly competitive. Extensive intramural and club sports programs draw heavy participation. Intramural basketball and soccer alone each boost roosters of more than 200 teams. UNC Chapel Hill offers competitive academics and a good social life as well. I would like to give it 4 stars out of 5 on quality of life at Chapel Hill. Well, now let's look at the financial fit. UNC Chapel Hill falls in an affordable school category, but the expenditure depends on the program as well. You can expect anything about $40,000 to about $60,000 in annual tuition expenses, with some postgraduate classes going up to $70,000 for most. The housing and dining may fall about $15,000 to $20,000 for most programs. As well as financial aid is concerned, UNC Chapel Hill offers a lot of scholarship opportunities. UNC awards a limited number of highly competitive merit scholarships, along with more than 600 athletic scholarships in 28 sports. I would like to give it 5 stars out of 5 on financial fit. After exploring the fit, let's move to the most curious section on how to double or even triple your chances of getting into UNC Chapel Hill with my special admission tips and strategy. The ideas I'm going to share now come from a decade-long experience working with students for career and college admission, and we help students in applying to all set of universities across the globe. Where well, UNC Chapel Hill is one of the most elite universities and moderately selective. The acceptance rate last year was about 25% overall, with a 91% graduation rate which is really good at the university of this size. UNC Chapel Hill considers eight factors as a very important to the admission process. These are rigor of your high school or college course load, standardized tests such as SAT or ACT for undergrad, GRE, GMAT for postgraduate. Next is your essays, then letters of recommendation, extracurricular activities, important talent or ability, your character or personal qualities, and state residency. Now, this is not relevant for international students. Items that are important as part of the admission process are GPA, class rank, voluntary work, and paid work experience. UNC applies holistic admission approach whenever evaluating applications for admission and discusses them at length before extending an offer of admission. What university emphasizes on is that they don't have an ideal student in mind. Rather, they like being surprised by each individual applicant's interest and talents. But they admit that some common themes still tend to emerge among their favorites. I want you to listen to these themes carefully and model your application around these themes. They love students who are smart, motivated, service-oriented, curious, creative, and courageous. Try to incorporate these themes in your profile, and more important than just your profile, model these characteristics in your life, as not only you will flourish in college admission, but also in your life. 
UNC looks for these characteristics as they believe these students will not only flourish in but actively enhance their college community while they are here. Admission to graduate school academic program is competitive and students are selected on the basis of their academic preparation, ability and program fit. For some programs, an on-site pre-admission interview may be required. The university relies mainly on email to communicate with all applicants. So therefore, do include a current email address on your application and be sure to promptly respond whenever they reach out to you. As for deadlines for admission, UNC offers two deadlines for undergraduate students, that is early action and is about generally October 15th for the preceding year of your entry year. And the other is regular decision, which is about January 15th. You can use either common application or coalition application to apply to UNC Chippewa. For all postgraduate courses, they have individual department deadline with either one or two deadlines between October to March every year. Transfer applicants are welcomed as well, depending upon the ability with application deadlines. This is about 15th of February. The process is similar to undergraduate freshman admissions. Well, in the end, to conclude, if you are diligent, hardworking, love a peaceful environment, fun-loving, research-oriented, UNC Chapel Hill is for you. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. Really appreciate it. Please make sure to support my work by liking and sharing this video. And also subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon. But well, if you want to get admission to UNC Chapel Hill or other top universities, I would highly recommend you to check out this course on college admission. I have created this course with 11 years of my expertise and helped thousands of students to get admitted to top colleges such as Howard, MIT, Stanford, Oxford, and all the other top colleges around the world. Well, this course packs the most advanced college application and admission strategies for university shortlisting, profile building, essay writing, college interviews, and everything else that will make sure you get into the school of your choice. It's a short ticket for your dream college admission. Well, thank you once again, and I'll be back with another amazing video for you. Till then, this is Shirish signing off. Take care and have a good one. Bye -bye.